Has Londoners await the Bank of England's verdict on whether we have seen yet another period of negative growth? One of the capital's institutions in particular will be waiting with bated breath. The humble pub has of late faced an uphill struggle against rising rates and dwindling profits. With over 30 pubs nationwide closing every day, the fight to stay in business is a daily battle. Clerkenwell is home to the highest concentration of independent pubs in central London and a team of no-sweat journalists have visited the area to find out if there is a future for our independent pubs. As giant chain pubs become increasingly popular, the small independent pubs which were once so widespread are on the decline. Clerkenwell in north-east London is a bustling commuter hub, historically famous for its centuries-old pubs and markets. The owner of the first pub we visited knows all too well the challenges of keeping his family business afloat. Richard Burton has run the pub for years and told us about his experiences. Uh, a manager will get paid regardless of what's happening, whereas an independent, as, as uh, a boss, you have to pay the bills and you have to take the money. It's your money that's being lost. Price wars have meant that big hitters like Weatherspoons and Yates's are impossible to compete with on prices. Smaller pubs have to offer something different, as proprietor Peter Taylor explains. A chain-run pub, they have no choice in uh, the food they put on uh, or the selection of drinks, so we can uh, make a difference. Uh, for example, our menu can be uh, a little more exciting, not so bland, and we can choose uh, if we want to put on uh, whatever, a quiz or darts or anything like that, whereas uh, in the chains there, there, is no, uh, there is no leeway, you do what you're told. And the punters, it would appear, prefer their pubs with an individual touch. It's the atmosphere, drink selection and food, definitely food. I think monopolies in any business are, are, are very, very bad for the consumer um, and I like variety, so I'd, I will definitely choose an independent pub over a chain pub any day of the week. Deals on food and slashing prices may help in the short term to bring in custom during the traditionally tight winter months. It remains to be seen whether these small family businesses can ride the storm. This latest addition to the scene in Clerkenwell will certainly be hoping so.